Hey, how's it going? In this video, someone asked me the question, should I use automatic placements or should I use manual placements, okay? So I'm just going to answer it right now. Okay, If you have no idea what I'm talking about, Facebook Business Manager, okay? Uh, this one, running ads, for example. If you're on the ad set level, you can choose whether you want to uh, choose automatic placements or manual placements. Placements is basically uh, the position in your feed that uh, you want your ad to be placed, okay? In this sense, uh, for example, like on Facebook or Instagram, right? It's where uh, there are many different placements. So let, let me just show you, okay? Automatic is basically allowing Facebook to optimize itself and allowing them to uh, choose which placement that you want uh, your ad to be, sh to be shown, okay? So they will be based on their optimization, their data, whereas manual placement is you selecting where you want your ad to be shown, okay? So if you go uh, on auto automatic placements and manual placements here, for example, if you want to totally exclude Instagram, you don't want to advertise on Instagram, for example, for example, your, your audience is mainly uh, older people on Facebook, for example, you can just exclude Instagram automatically. Okay, so uh, you can see here, um, Instagram feed, um, Instagram feed, Instagram explore, for example, you can untick, untick, right? And for example, a lot of, uh, I, I'm not sure, I drop trippers, they always mention just do it for the feed because feed is like the, the biggest thing that people see. Right, so it's the most obvious uh, piece of content placement that there is. So that's why a lot of people mention the feed as well. Personally, just my personal opinion, I I don't care. I will put automatic placements all the all the time. And the reason why is because Facebook knows better than us. How I I always uh, see this and justify this is that like if Facebook has all the data and they are recommending you an automatic placements, um, and they understand what is going to work and what is not, I rather them optimize and then I focus on uh, producing the best creative on my part. Right, so I don't think it's something that you should really think about. Uh, but if you wanna try just doing manual placements instead, you should definitely do it. But also keep in mind, right, manual placements. If you go feed only, it's gonna be more expensive generally than just doing automatic placements because there's more uh, real estate that you can advertise in. Right, so uh, just keep that in the back of your mind. And personally, I I don't know. I I don't like. Uh, I don't need to complicate things. If there's automatic placement, just let it run. I'll let it run. Right, and if the reverse is good, the reverse is good. If it's not, then change the creative. How we see it is like, um, perhaps sometimes when we meet a buyer, we think about these mi minor things too much, whereas you should posit uh, think more about uh, the creative and how to make the offer sexier so that it sells better, right? So as long as you get the, the traffic from Facebook and then you drive it to the site, you I think you'll be settled. I, I don't think it should be a problem, okay? So um, you can definitely try. Last time I, I used to be a geek <laughs> and then I really obsessed about these small things. Like I was like, like yeah, manual placements, Feed only is is, is is the best, right? But then now nowadays I, I, I don't really care. Like uh I just focus on the creative at this point in time. Yep. So um that that's pretty much my opinion. And I don't think that is uh it'll hurt if you test it as well. Okay? Your ad account may be different and my ad account may be different as well. So just keep that in mind. Okay? Hopefully that answers your question. Um and yeah, okay. Um even though it might seem very, very weird that for example Messenger, the Messenger placement, where is it? Like Messenger? Like there, there, there's uh there's a placement for that and sometimes it, it doesn't even convert right but you may never know like for all audi your your audience it may convert you get what I mean so just just I think automatic placements first and then if you really want to slim down after you're in the set the testing phase right you go and see the data and then see which placements are doing the best and then you use those which are getting purchases and then you divert that that traffic and create another duplicate that campaign and then you go and for example focus on the feed focus on Instagram uh stories or whatever. Okay, just my opinion. Um, let me know what you think. Um, if you have any questions, please put them down in the comment section below so I can help you answer them as well and help you guys. Uh, yep, that's pretty much it. See you in the next video.